Congratulations, team, on the successful release of our 10,000th Star Wars film, Don Solo. The epic story of Hans's seventh cousin, twice removed. Well done. Now, as profitable as the Star Wars franchise has been to Disney, I think we can all agree it's time to move on, to pursue a more meaningful endeavor. <laughs> Stop it! Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I'm yelling. <laughs> but seriously, I need 10 new Star Wars films before lunch. <clears throat> okay, I know we've already made 197 movies about Luke's backstory. But what if we show him at the Jedi Temple exchanging some oversized robes? We could call it Returns of the Jedi. I love it. Next. A shot-for-shot -shot remake of Empire Strikes Back, except we replace Darth Vader's lightsaber with a smaller Darth Vader. Oh, oh. That is bold. But, as Yoda once said, do or do not as long as money it makes. <laughs> I also propose that we return to George Lucas's original vision and replace the Jawas with CGI Lucases. Okay. Yes, yes, I like it. Okay, now speaking of bold ideas, um, in The Phantom Menace, they talk about midichlorines? Ah, definitely the worst part about that movie. Because they didn't go into enough detail. Exactly. Now, how about we magic school bus this thing? We have a cartoon Qui-Gon Jinn in a microscopic spaceship inside Anakin, explaining how the Force works. Yes. Real nerds will love it for the science, and fake nerds will love it for Star Wars. But how do we attract the jocks? We make a sports-themed movie about an undersized, seven foot three Catholic Wookiee whose only dream is to play football for Notre Dame, called Chewy. Yes! Now what other completely original ideas do we have? 65 million years ago, in a galaxy far, far away, Darth Maul's great, great, great grandfather gets bitten by a space mosquito which is then preserved in space tree sap until the space scientist space extracts it. We call it Jurassic Park. Space. Wow. Oh. Wow, these are great, guys. But there is one incredibly obvious idea that honestly I'm kind of ashamed you've all overlooked. We've, we've thought of everything. There are no ideas left in the idea jar jar. Missy back. Does this photo look familiar? Yes. And we've created an individual film for each one of these stormtroopers. Even him? Ah! How could we have been so blind? This left foot belonged to someone. And just because that someone is a clone, with an identical backstory to everyone else doesn't mean that we can treat him like he was a piece of bansa poodoo. Especially considering we once made a Star Wars film with just the opening crawl. So we give him a trilogy. So we give him a saga. But we start with film four, then five, then two, eight, then one, six, nine, three, and finally seven, which we split into three parts. Oh my All right. Yes. Yes. Hey, sorry to interrupt, but Pixar just called. They need ideas for Cars 4. Wow. Pixar's getting desperate. <laughs> <laughs> How do you make a sequel? <laughs> Wally do! <laughs> Tori, you're new here. Mm -hmm. And as such, there's something I need to tell you. What? I am your father. Really? No. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, we'd love to get some comments about what Star Wars movie you'd like to see. I would like you to be my father. No. <laughs> <laughs>